Hi, in this tutorial, I will show you how to configure domain name in Tomcat. Under Tomcat folder, there is a folder called as Tom. Open this folder. You need to modify this file. I already have server.xml file opened. In this file, you need to add an entry called as host tag. It will look something like this. In host tag, under name property, you need to specify your domain name. Here, my domain name is yourwebsitename.com. Whatever is your domain name, you need to specify the domain name in name. The app base should be web apps. You need to have an entry called context. Keep path as blank. The doc base should contain your project name value. So whatever project you would have created and installed on Tomcat, you need to specify the folder of that project name. Now if you have some more aliases, alias means you have some other domains and you want all those domains to point your website name.com. Only in those situations you need to add a tag called as alias. So in alias tag you need to specify those other website name values. For example, here I have your website name dot co dot in, your website name dot in and three more entries. So these are the entries you need to mention in host tag. So that completes the configuration of domain name. I will show you one more point which is very important. By default the Tomcat will run on 8080 port. You need to modify the port value as 80 port so that whenever somebody gives the URL as your website name.com it will directly go to that website project. If you keep the project uh, sorry if you keep the port as default value 8080 in that case you need to specify the URL name colon 8080. To avoid that situation you just need to specify AT port. So these are the two points you need to modify in server.xml file. Now there is one more point uh, which I would like to highlight. In some cases you purchase virtual servers from different vendors like GoDaddy. So they will give you a virtual server. Sometimes those virtual servers will have IIS server installed on those machines and that server will by default using port 80. Since they already occupied the port 80, you will not be able to use same port again for Tomcat. So for that you need to release the port which is occupied by IIS and give it to Tomcat. 
to do that you need to go to that iis server stop the server that is one option stop iis server or modify the port on which iis server is listening so once you do that when somebody gives a domain name it will be redirected to tomcat so that's completes the end of tutorial thank you